How's this for a first in-person studio guest for Theoretically Speaking? What's up, y'all? It's Theo Dorsey, host of Theoretically Speaking, and we had Tyler Cameron in the house on Monday to talk about the NFL Draft and also to talk about his new show on Amazon Prime Video named Going Home with Tyler Cameron. Now, I am featured on the first episode. My house was renovated by Image One and the team. We talk a little about that as well as his NFL dreams that were shot down. But hey, The Bachelorette and now his own show and all of those followers on social media, I think he'll hint towards liking this side a little bit better. Here's the interview with Tyler Cameron. Our streaming as you see who just popped into the studios here. We got the one, the only Tyler Cameron in the house. What up? Can I get some celebration music or something? Can I get a Come little? Come on, Theo. That was great. That hey. was a great intro, man. Hey, hey, Tyler, Tyler from, from season 14 of The Bachelorette. Also, more importantly, more importantly from Going Home with Tyler Cameron, streaming on Amazon Prime Video. Tyler, uh, welcome to Theoretically Speaking. It is your debut. First and foremost, I got to get your opinion on the show name. You just had to come up with a show name for Amazon Prime. We got Theoretically Speaking right here. Better show name, me or you? You know, I think mine's a little bit more provocative. Yeah. But I think yours, it really fits what we're doing. Because people are like, mine could be a dating show. Mine could be this. Mine could be that. Mine could well, be what a, is it? Mine could be a pickup line, you know? But, <laughs> <laughs> Has it been a pickup line? Have you already used that one in the clubs since you've come out with the show? So I just did a little thing on Washington Square Park in New York City where I asked people, like, uh, would you go home with me? Would you go home with me? And it, it didn't work out well. No? A lot of no's. More no's than yeses? A lot more no's than yeses. I'm surprised. What, what's what's happening here? Who are you asking? I don't know. Washington, Washington Square Park's a little bit tough. Yeah. You know, it's a tough crowd and maybe too tough for me. Well, that's why you, you brought it back home to Jupiter. Exactly. You brought it back home to Jupiter, and that's what the show is all about. If you haven't watched Going Home with Tyler Cameron on Amazon Prime Video, first and foremost, skip the first episode. Because that's my episode. <laughs> no, you can't skip that, man. You get you get a beautiful episode with Theo and Ashley. You get a lot of tears. Yeah, uh, it is a beautiful episode. Um, they were the best clients. You guys, you guys are incredible. I don't know why we're speaking third person. Right, right I'm like I'm right here in yeah, front of you, man. My bad, my bad. <laughs> but you guys were incredible. Look, we got the ladies. They want to go home with Tyler Cameron. I see that. See What's now, up? this is the one thing I was worried about here at the, our the Square Studios at ESPN West Palm. We do have a window, and people can look in, and they're seeing Tyler Cameron. They're already stopping and taking selfies with the man as we're trying to get through the radio show. Yeah, show your fans some love. I know that the NFL stuff didn't work out, and it's this NFL draft week, and there's a lot of guys that's going to send off there and go play professional football I mean seven eight years later are you kind of glad looking at now where your life is that it didn't definitely de I mean I think this has more longevity to it I was going to be a guy who's just scraping to get on a, on a practice squad or a 53-man roster every year and just yeah. banging my head in it for you know just to try and make the minimum wage of the league which is a, which is a healthy wage it's pretty good yeah, it's I'll a healthy take wage it actually, yeah. but <laughs> I think what I do now is a lot more fun uh I get to use my mind for something else now and uh I'm very grateful for where I am, but football has definitely instilled the success that I have today because all the discipline, all the things I've been through. Right, and it gave you that strength because you used that sledgehammer in the, the show. Sledgehammer, yes, well, sir. <laughs> you know, and I think it gave me some muscles that these ladies like on the TV, so it works. It all works out. It all works out.